Hello YouTube and welcome to another Linux tutorial. So today I'm going to show you how you can use the watch command in Linux. So are you ready? Let's get started. So actually the watch command is used to run any command at regular intervals and the default is 2 seconds. So I will show you how. So let's say for example we want to show the time so there is a comment for that is date but as you can see it displayed the time at a specific instant or snapshot actually if you want to refresh this display here or this time here we can use the watch command so if I type watch then my command which is date as you can see every two seconds my time will be actually refreshed so it's the default interval is two seconds okay so as you can see here the seconds are incrementing two seconds by two seconds so if I want to quit all I have to do is to hit control plus C okay so as I told you the default is two seconds but if I want to make it just one second, all I have to do is to add option minus N, then one for one second. And now you can see the time is fresh in every one second. Okay. If you want actually to highlight the changes, you have to add or you can add minus T. And I tap enter and this time you see the second are highlighted because it's being changed I hit ctrl C to exit I'll write it again as you can see here in the top of my console here I have this title here if I want to get rid of this title it's pretty easy all I have to do is to add option minus T. As you can see, it displays now just my comment. Of course, this comment is not used to display the date, but we can use it to display other things. For example, to display the memory, free memory. There is a comment for that is free minus M. As you can see, it gives me the total of my memory that I have and the used memory. But that was just a snapshot at a definite instant. For example, if I open a program or something, I have to, to execute it another time in order to get my numbers refreshed. But I can use here the command watch in order to see it live. So if I tap, for example, watch, then my command free minus M, as you can see now, every two seconds, the used memory is being refreshed so if I open for example something like a text it will increase okay so here the text is empty but I can just open something else as you can see the memory is increasing actually if I close it will decrease okay you can also execute two commands at the same time so it's pretty easy you can just type watch and I type this sign here then my first command for example free minus n and minus n and this sign here which stands for the end logical end and I can add another command for example I can type the disk free minus h for a human readable format so here I have two commands that I want to execute and to watch every two seconds so if I tap enter yes actually I have the display for the first command here at the top and the display for the second command here at the bottom of the window 
and as I told you if I want to get rid of title it's pretty easy all I have to do is to add option minus T I can even add option minus T to get the changes and I hit enter okay you see the number that I highlighted are being changed so that was just an introduction to this very useful command called watch that can help you to monitor your system or your files as always i hope it has been informative for you and i want to thank you for viewing bye bye